Hello and welcome to CGD Games. My name's Lee, aka CGD, and today I'm going to show you how to check in passengers. Uh, there are a couple of ways uh, to check in your passengers uh, when you pick them up, and the best way to do both of those is, well, I'll show you right now. So the first thing you're going to need to do when you do arrive uh, where your passengers are waiting is if you ring up, I always bring up the wrong one, so if you press and hold X on your Xbox controller, so you switch all these on, so your tea and coffee facilities, your Wi-Fi, your toilets, uh, the monitors for the passengers, uh, don't put your announcement on just yet, but this is your most important one, this is your destination display. Now, at the moment the desti destination display is set to off, Okay, so remember that, it's off at the moment. So we'll put the lights on so they can all read if it gets a little bit dark. So, secondly, what we're going to need to do, on the Xbox controller, you've got the button that usually pauses your game, one of the games, but it looks three lines, I like to call it the burger button. So if you press that, it brings up your mobile device. So if you highlight login, make sure that's logged in there, okay? And then you can come out of that then. So, if you remember back from about 15, 20 seconds ago, I mentioned this, your destination display. So that is still off. So, oh, one more thing before we do get out, what we need to do, because we are going to be checking these people in. Let's open some doors so they can get on. So, you can see we've got all these lovely people waiting for us outside in the rain, so we won't keep them too long. Make sure you open the luggage compartment as well. As you see, the guys with the bags, the icons, they will disappear and you're able to check them. So, when you first start the game, you have to manually check um, your passengers in. in. So, here we see, we'll approach this uh, passenger now, and usually you would press A. Hey, where are you they are. It says, where are we bound for? Now, the reason for that being, is we haven't put our destination board on. It was a mistake I made regularly, regularly um, when I first started playing. So switch that on now. As you can see, it comes up with our destination there in a little window. So we'll go back out to the passenger. And now you will notice that when we approach him, press A, we're able to check him in. So this is the way that you would check him in normally before you reach level 4, which I will get to shortly. As you can see, his name is James Mars. So as you can see on the left there, we have a list of names. Um, so his name is James Mars. His name is on the list there. He is number 8. So we press A. A again. So he's checked in. He will now disappear onto the bus. So then we go to this gentleman here. His name is Andreas Straub. Is he on the list? Is he on the list or not? on there. I guess he is. He is on the list. So we check him in. Let's try this young man here. Um, his name is Henrik Berg. Now, when he brings up the phone like that, obviously he doesn't say his name. If you press RB, it goes to his passenger information. Henrik Berg. So, is, is his name? Yes, he is number one. He is on there. So that's how you would do it. Eventually, you will come across, I was hoping we would, Amelia Otte. She is on the list as well, she's on the floor. She's usually these young ladies with sun hats on, who aren't on there. Luis Rare, she is on the list as well. So what I'm looking for here is someone who's not actually on the list. Melanie. Melanie. Yes, she's right at the bottom. Hello. Julius Whaler. Sorry if I'm getting these yet. He's on the list as well. We are going to come across someone short who's not on that list. Frederick Wise is on the list as well. This is going to be the one and only town where I'm recording the video. Henrietta Edda. That everybody in this uh, group of people. Right, so there. I cannot see this young lady on the list at all. 
she is not on the list. So as you can see at the bottom of the screen now, it says B for no, big red cross. We do not allow her on the on the uh, on the bus. We say no. Okay. So that's the manual way of booking a passenger. Now once you get to level four, you can use express check-in. So press A. Okay, and then press and hold X. There you see, and press and hold X again. And it scans her in. Easy as that. So you press A. Press X. Well, on the sheet, you press and hold X. And it checks the passenger in. We want one more over here. And then we've got uh, customers that would like to pay um, here and now. Press and hold X. And he's allowed on the bus. So now we've got these guys who would like a ticket. So they would like to go to Leon. So what we do here, it brings up our phone, we press Y, we scroll down to Leon. Get that shortly. There we go. We press Y again. We check with X. Right, that's their, that's their code there. And we press A. Press A again, and she is on the bus. Now we've got this young man who likes to go to Leon as well. We scroll down to Leon. There it is. Press Y. Check. Comes up there, QR code. Tap A. Tap A again, and he is on the bus. So that's everybody on the bus, apart from this young lady. So, we close the luggage door. On our bus, close the doors. Okay, so departure time is two minutes past nine. It's now five past ten. I'm already late because of the purpose of the, uh, the video. That's why I'm a little bit late. So, the first thing you need to do once you get on the bus, you should have everything else set up. Put your announcement on, get that out of the way, and also make sure you set your air conditioning to a nice 21 degrees in the summer months. It's nice and cool. And uh, lets everybody enjoy the ride comfortably. And that's how you check your passengers in, ladies and gentlemen. Once you've done that, you can be on your... Oh, one more thing before I disappear. Bring up your phone again and bring and highlight start ride. Do not forget to start ride. It's, it's good for XP, especially if you are levelling up one to four. So click that and then you can come out of it and you can start your ride. Don't forget to start your ride. So that's it, ladies and gentlemen. That's how to book in your passengers on Fernbus Simulator on the Xbox Series S or X or PlayStation 5. I really do appreciate you watching the video. Thank you very much for joining me. If you haven't already, please do consider hitting that subscribe button. It would be very much appreciated. And give the video a like. Giving that video a like helps get this video out into the YouTube algorithm and helps more people find my content. I really do appreciate you stopping by, and I'll see you all on the next one. Bye.